Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel and welcome to another hair video. In today's video, I'm going to be showing you how I took my brunette client to a really pretty like dark blue, light blue highlights and purple highlights. So I started off since she was pretty brunette, um, but her hair wasn't like super dark. I started off by putting lightener all over her head and I started doing like the ends or mids to ends first and then I went ahead and put it all over her roots. I also did a strand test in the beginning. I did 10 volume and 20 volume and 20 volume lifted a lot better for the colors that she wanted. So I decided to do 20 volume and it lifted really, really well since she had virgin hair and she's been grinding out for, for a really long time. So she didn't have like any previous color on her hair. So it lifted perfectly. And I was really excited to do this really pretty color and something different than I'm usually like doing at school. So a little disclaimer, if you guys are not in beauty school or you're not a licensed professional, make sure you don't do this at home. Um, I'm not telling you to go do this at home. Just a little disclaimer, I was doing this at school and my educator said it was perfectly fine to do this and they also the clients sign a waiver when they come to the school um so yeah I just wanted to let you guys know that I did do this at school and we also don't have like Olaplex or anything like that which I would normally want to put in the products before to protect the hair or put in the lightener, but um, we don't have that school, so I definitely recommend that if you do work in a salon, definitely put some Olaplex or just something to protect the hair because you are putting a lot of lightener in the hair, but my client was perfectly fine with it, and yeah, just a little disclaimer to let you guys know what happened here. And like I said, she lifted beautifully, and I was super excited with doing this process. And um, yeah, I ended up drying her after the lightning process. And then after drying, I ended up putting the highlights in, and then the like the blue. And yeah, you guys will just see in the rest of the video here what I did like for the rest of the process. Tonight I'm gonna feel like And no one won't be up tonight So baby go and start a fight I'm in love with the city lights I'm in love of a big star I've got my girls and I've got my car Right, guys so here's my process here since my client wanted the purple and the lighter blue like streaks through her hair I decided to just go from start from the nape of her hair and go kind of through all over and I did um, I put foils in and I did purple and I kind of like did them like ran at random I did purple and then blue and then purple blue and like you know kind of like went every other one just so she had that really pretty purple and blue highlights through her entire head she didn't want them to be like super um, subtle she did want them to be kind of like chunkier 
so I took like bigger pieces and um, like I said I just like went through the entire head and I just did like every other one I did purple then I did blue then purple blue and kind of went through the top of her head like that and all throughout she did have a ton of hair as you I don't know if you can tell in the video but it was like so thick so I literally like used so much product if you do have clients like that um, just make sure you fully saturate the hair because you want to make sure when you're doing like colors like this you want to make sure the color really like soaks through the hair otherwise you're gonna have like patches of blonde hair so that's just a little tip that I've done that before on a client and I was like oh no like it didn't fully saturate saturate the hair so if you do have clients with thicker hair make sure it's fully saturated if you have to like lift the hair and make sure it's um, on every highlight but yeah just make sure it's fully saturated because you do not want to have like blonde pieces showing through the clients like bright blue colors so yeah just a little tip there but um yeah that's what i was doing here okay so just mixed her base all over color which is going to be this admiral navy color and it's really pretty i'm excited put this on Alright, so as you guys can tell, I'm using a balayage board on her hair. Also, one of my biggest tips is when a client has a lot of hair, or even if they don't have a lot of hair, um, use a balayage board because it literally like saves me every single time I do color, especially like fun colors like this, to make sure the hair is fully saturated doing or using a balayage board like helps out a lot it just keeps everything straight and helps like um with the hair like staying really nice and tight so you can apply the color so it's nice and saturated so definitely recommend doing that as you can tell i'm using the color and kind of applying it all around um the foils if you are doing this just make sure that you're taking like really small sections and kind of going through like the entire head like i said before it's so easy to have like streaks of blonde showing through this color so make sure it's fully saturated because playing or putting like fun colors on someone else's hair um you just want to make sure it's fully saturated and i can't tell you guys enough like that's my biggest tip make sure it's fully saturated because like i said before i've done this uh, mistake before where i didn't fully saturate it and then there's like little streaks of blonde showing through so just make sure you go through it like a million times and make sure it's fully saturated but it turned out so pretty and i really liked it and was really proud of how it turned out and yeah So this is what my client wanted with her hair and I ended up styling her by just um, doing like really loose beach curls which is what I do on most of my clients and her color turned out so good you guys I'm so proud of it I am just like obsessed with how pretty and vibrant the colors were and my client absolutely loved it it turned out very similar to the picture she showed me and it really brought out all the purple highlights and the light blue highlights 
but just looked so beautiful. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video on turning my client or my brunette client from brunette to blue and purple highlights. Please give me a thumbs up if you liked it. Also, don't forget to subscribe to my channel and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye guys. Thank you so much for watching.